We're headed to Bermuda's westernmost tip to explore the island's biggest attraction, Dockyard. It's home to the island's largest cruise ship pier, and it's also packed with tons of shops, restaurants, and exciting attractions. There's actually so much to see and do, you can spend your entire vacation here. But if you have just one day to spend, I'll show you some must-see highlights. So put on a pair of comfortable walking shoes and get ready to go exploring as we spend the day in Dockyard. Well, it's 9 a.m. and it looks like the shops are opening. Let's go check it out. The commanding clock tower is a stunning arcade of shops in a unique setting. The most discerning shopper is sure to find something appealing while strolling along the stone paved passages. If you're looking for island inspired apparel or gifts, you'll find them here, as well as unique boutiques, art galleries, and tempting treats. Just next door is Making Waves for Surf Gear and the Dockyard Pharmacy for Healthcare Products. Close by is Island Outfitters, your one-stop shop for island adventure, or practically anything else you might need. Many artisans also call Dockyard home. Just along the road from the Clock Tower Mall are the studios of the Bermuda Clayworks, where you'll find outstanding artistic ceramics. Next door, skilled craftsmen at the Glassworks demonstrate their talent for creating functional glassware, as well as creative masterpieces. Bermuda's famous rum cakes are also made here by expert bakers. Once you taste a sample, you're sure to want to take some home with you. Or get on over to Bear Me Berry and choose from their tempting flavors of frozen yogurt and toppings. Delicious. I think it's time for coffee, and the pastry shop makes the best cappuccino on this side of the Atlantic. Even better, their pastries are baked fresh right here in their kitchen every day. No day old donuts here. Although the Royal Navy pulled out in the 1950s, this is still a working dockyard with a thriving yachting and boating community. You can learn all about the history of Dockyard at the historical reenactment performed at the Vittling Yard three mornings a week. Take the walking tour that immediately follows the reenactment and discover even more about this fascinating 200-year-old former naval base. From here, you can go parasailing for an amazing bird's eye view of Bermuda, go deep sea fishing for marlin, tuna, or wahoo, charter a sailboat to explore the island, or my favorite, hop on a jet ski for some real speed on the water. If you've ever dreamed of swimming with dolphins, your dream can come true right here at Dolphin Quest, located within the walls of the National Museum of Bermuda. Dolphin Quest offers encounters where you can swim, touch, and even kiss a dolphin. An unforgettably fun and inspiring experience. When it's time for lunch, there are tons of restaurant choices right here in Dockyard, including this unique pub, the Frog and Onion. It's located in a 200-year-old naval cooperage, which is where they used to build and repair kegs, barrels, and casks. So in keeping with its naval history, there's a microbrewery right here on site. So in addition to some fantastic pub grub, you'll get a creative and certainly one of the biggest beers in Bermuda. Many of the restaurants offer afternoon entertainment, such as local piano and guitar favorites. Ownfish Bar and Grill has an award-winning chef and a fabulous patio with stunning views, while the family-style restaurant Cafe Amici serves delicious pasta and other Italian favorites. And for local fresh-caught fish dishes, try Woody's. Well, it's time to walk off that lunch. And fortunately, you never know what type of history you might uncover as you walk through Bermuda's trails, parks, 
and peaceful green spaces. This is one of my favorite places in all of Bermuda, just to sit and relax. And the best part is, it's just a few minutes outside of Dockyard's gates. It doesn't get much better than this. A beautiful view, a cool breeze in my face. There's no place I'd rather be. Another option for a lazy afternoon is the snorkel park. You can lounge on a day bed, relax on the pink sand beach, or take a dip in the warm, calm water. But if you want to get more active, there's also snorkeling, paddle boats, kayaks, water slides, and beach volleyball. By the way, you don't have to walk around Dockyard to see all these fantastic attractions. You can cruise around on your own two wheels by renting a Segway. You can travel in a more traditional manner by renting a bicycle or ride in comfort aboard the trolley-style train. The train makes a continuous loop around all the major dockyard attractions and is free to ride. So hop on and hop off at any of the stops. You can even golf here in Dockyard by putting your way around the globe. Fun Golf is an oceanfront miniature golf course that has recreated 18 of the world's most challenging holes, like this one, number 12 from Augusta National. Well, it's four o'clock, but there's still enough time in the day to enjoy a few cultural and historical attractions. The British Royal Navy established the Royal Naval Dockyard after defeat in the American War of Independence. Its purpose was to create a massive fortification and stronghold for the Royal Navy to ensure British dominance of the Western Atlantic. You can learn all about Dockyard and 500 years of local history right here at the Bermuda National Museum. Another thing that I love, you could check your Facebook page, tweet your friends on Twitter, or send a plain old email, since all of Dockyard is a Wi-Fi hotspot. Just grab your mobile device, search for an available network, and log on. The rates are reasonable, and it's as easy as pushing a button. The wonderful old rooms of the Cooperage make an appropriate setting for the craft market. On sale is a fascinating selection of locally made products, such as cedar items, handcrafted jewelry, painted clothes, books, prints, and delicious Bermuda-made condiments. Many of the products are made right in front of your eyes. You can also sample locally produced fare. Nearby is the Art Center, where you'll see works by the island's most accomplished artists. Some pieces are available for sale. And if the kids want to run around while you browse, there's a wonderful playground right opposite. And when the sun goes down, Dockyard keeps on going. The very latest blockbuster movies play here at the Neptune Cinema. The pubs and bars come to life, the dining is outstanding, and amazing island entertainment and parties can be found throughout Dockyard. My day in Dockyard's been a blast, and yet there's so much more to do. You know what? I think I'll be back tomorrow. Bermuda is home to the 2017 America's Cup and the America's Cup Village is currently being constructed here at Dockyard. This will be the beating heart of the experience, with all the team bases, a pit row, food and beverage, entertainment and concerts taking place right here. To find out more about the Royal Naval Dockyard, visit our website or pick up a brochure at the Visitor Information Center or Clock Tower Mall.